everyone, welcome back to the Integrity Botanicals YouTube channel. Since we are well into summer, I mean, I feel like we're easing out of summer, but I'm in South Florida, so I have no real concept of seasons. Um, I wanted to take the time to share with you some body products that I've really been loving. Take a step away from the makeup because this is the time where I feel like a lot of us really change up our body routine, a lot more skins exposed, a lot more shavings happening. So in turn, a lot more moisturization, SPF, scrubbing, you know the drill. Um, so I'm actually gonna start off with the newest drop that I think I have in the collection here. And one that there's actually a really great offer going on with, in case you guys wanted to scoop something up. And this is the Rawa Enchanted Island Lotion Mist. And it's exactly what it sounds. It is a lotion in a mist form. It has an aloe base, so it's really soothing. Even though it's mist out, it still has a thickness to it. It's not super thin. But then when you rub it in, it just completely melts in, gives you a little dose of hydration, smells absolutely beautiful, but not at all overpowering. It just have a bit of a fruity scent. It's just really great. So I like to use it in the summertime because it's just really quick, easy, effective, especially when I've been in the sun for a while, my skin can really dry out and I like to top off with something like this. Not only that, it's great for travel. It's super easy and I think is encourages many of us to apply a lotion where um, I'm just like already obsessed with lotion, but I know for some people it's like a big to do. This doesn't leave any sort of residue on the skin. So I think it's really, really approachable. If you're looking and to try this item, we are currently running an offer while supplies last for a free mini travel size of the Rawa Enchanted Island Lotion Mist. And you will receive that free using code um, lotion or island mist. I'm going to include that down below when you purchase any two full size Rawa products or more, of course. So I love a lot of Rawa products. If you would like me to sit down and do a video on my picks, I know they've come out with so many products over the years. I definitely will do that. Um, I love their dry shampoo. I like their texture sort of cream. I like, um, I, I just like Rawa. I just like the scent of a lot of their products. But if you want me to do a video on that, I can. But in the meantime, this offer is going on but even if you don't decide to go ahead with the offer just pick up a big old bottle of this stuff because it's great and I've been using it quite a bit next up is a product that has not come to me yet because I used it up and I needed a replenishment but I still have to share it with you all because I am that much obsessed with it um, and it is the Kahina Giving Beauty Belle D soap so this comes in a neroli scent a rose scent and a eucalyptus scent I believe um, my favorite is the rose because it just has that really true non-artificial rose scent that I think is so so beautiful but beyond that use this to shave your legs if you have dry legs use this in lieu of a um of a shaving cream i think that this performs so much better it gives you that slip that you need so you don't get any nicks or anything like that but it also provides a lot of hydration to the skin it's a very jelly type of form it's sort of fun and when you take it out it turns like it it turns to a soap because it is a soap so you will get a little bit of a lather and i like to use it on my legs i use it underneath my arms anywhere where i'm shaving i will use this product and I am in love with it there is nothing like it it's one of those products that I have loved I think like for four or five years now and will always constantly be in rotation if nothing else get that it is incredible I love it now I live in South Florida and I think a lot of places where it's quite humid you know the mosquitoes are out in the summertime so I need some form of bug repellent and the bug repellent I've been using lately is from cosmetology this is their bug repellent skin balm so I really like these options because a lot of the conventional options first of all you know they're ridden with chemicals but not only that um, they just smell so strong and so off-putting this is like very like scentless basically and it's in a balm form so I just like to warm it up I'll apply it like on the back of my ankles on the back of my arms that's usually where the bugs really like to like to bite and it's just really easy to apply and effective so this like comes with me in the purse I absolutely need this and I don't hear anyone ever talk about bug repellent but here in South Florida that is like an issue I am actively dealing with so I'm testing this there's a couple other options on the website as well that I haven't got a chance to try but in the meantime this has been 
like a lifesaver because I get eaten alive and there's nothing more miserable when you're trying to enjoy your time outside and you're just itching uncontrollably, you know what I mean? Moving right along to a body wash. Now, this is another one I used up. You will see that this is full and you're gonna be like, what the hell, Ashley, have you even used this? Yes, I've used it time and time again. I just got a re-up on it because it is like the best summer body wash and it just so happened to work out where I actually ran out of all of mine so this came in just in time and this is from Red Flower. This is their purifying body wash in the ocean scent. I mean, need I say any more? It is so, not only is it perfect for the season, I just feel like it's perfect for the shower. It's a really uplifting, fresh, beautiful ocean-like scent as you could imagine. Get a nice lather on these guys as well, which I love. It almost has a little bit of a, um, what's that, like very minty, fresh type of vibe to it as well. And I just love that. I am so excited to get this in the shower and use it once again. Um, but the packaging is biodegradable and biocompostable. The formula is just really great. I mean, how much can I really say about body wash other than it performs great and I love the scent and that is really all that matters. So if you haven't checked out the Red Flower body washes, they come in a variety of different scents, even if the ocean isn't really calling to you, which how could it not? But just in case it's not, they have other fragrances that I strongly, strongly recommend, but the ocean is just too perfect. Let's talk about an SPF, and this is one that I completely used up and repurchased as well. So like, like I always say in all my videos, I mean, I live here, so I guess it makes sense, but I live in South Florida, so I really deal with the elements of like heat and needing to like good scrubs, good lotions, SPF all day. Um, I just use these things really, really routinely and go through them super regularly. And one that will be forever in the lineup now is from Babo Botanicals, and this is their sheer uh, zinc sunscreen. This is an SPF 30 that is in a spray form. And I love a spray form, first of all, because it's just really easy to apply. Um, I feel like it doesn't leave a white cast all over the skin. And it's just really, really approachable. So I use this on a day-to-day -day basis whenever I'm wearing something where my arms are exposed um, because I, I'm driving a lot here in Florida as well. I just like the sun. Like I feel it start like cooking my skin. So I just make sure it just like shh, get my arms. I of course take this with me when I'm at the beach. I do like a little bit of a lower SPF factor for my body. That way I can really build it up on the shoulders, but every Everywhere else I can still get a little bit of color because I don't want it to deter from that as well. So I think an SPF 30 is perfect for every day. I use the hell out of this and it is so easy breezy to use. I absolutely love it. So it's a zinc oxide that is the active ingredient in here and um, it's 80 minutes water and sweat resistant so great for the beach. It's hypoallergenic. It's a sheer formula like I said so it goes on like a dream. If you didn't know we have this on the site, run. If you like the Neutrogena ultra sheer body mist. This is your all natural alternative and Babo's always really reasonably priced as well. That option is also fragrance free so you don't have to worry about any of that which I love. Now moving along let's talk about a body scrub because like I said more limbs out more shaving happening. We have a lot of great scrubs on the website but mine and Terry's personal favorite is from One Love Organics and this is their Botanical Sea Body polish. You know when you read the reviews of this stuff, it has great reviews. It's a little bit more of a granule texture, which I personally love because I do like a bit more of a gritty scrub. Um, I always do this before I shave my legs as opposed to after because, you know, if it, there's like any open... I don't want to call it an open wound, but you know what I mean. So this is a little bit more of a granule texture. The scent of it is really great. It is immersed in a bunch of beautiful oils. So they just say you massage this into wet skin and circular motions, sort of get it all going, rinse with warm water, really, really fuss free, but highly, highly effective scrub. Uh, what I like about this is since it is a little bit more granule, it's not totally immersed in oil where you are actually getting that scrubbing effect rather than just really nice hydration. But what I do like about natural scrubs is that they are immersed in that oil because then your legs are left with a hydrating film that isn't sticky or gross, but prevents your legs from almost getting like ashy once you get out of the shower, if you know what I mean. A scrub is necessary, and this one from One Love Organics is phenomenal. All right, and I'm going to round this off with another lotion option. Again, I just think it's important the more we shave, the more to hydrate, but I know how unsettling it could be, especially when it's hot out, to have thick, 
overpowering lotion. So I already mentioned the Rawa, that one's great. The special is also fantastic. I say go for it. But a second runner up is from Cosmetology and they do these really fantastic lotion bars. And what I love, love, love about these that they come in like a deodorant stick format. So you could literally just take them, run them wherever you want and then just rub it into the skin. So this leaves a little bit more of a film than something like the Rawa. The Rawa just like kind of is drank right into the skin. This is a really nice little bit more hydrating option. It comes in a variety of scents. I have the grapefruit, which I really like. I just think the application of me application method of this is so genius. I think the results are beautiful and a little bit of this goes a long way. So you don't need to apply coats upon coats upon coats. You can really just do one pass, rub it all over the leg and you will be ready to go. I forgot about this option, but then the warmer months roll around and I pull it back out and it's just been a treat. I really, really like this. Um, so that's it everyone. Those are all of my body care picks from summer from summer, for summer. I tried to do something from every category. I hope that you enjoyed seeing my favorite picks. I think body products are the things that I use the most consistently. It's just more surface area, you know what I mean? So I would love to know what your favorite body products are. Let me know that if this inspired you to pick anything up. If you need recommendations in for, for anything in a department I didn't address, but I think I got them all, let me know. But as always, I'm going to link every single item that I discussed in this video in the description box down below so you could shop them right here, right now. But before you go and check out all the good stuff I leave in the description box, including the makeup I'm wearing as well as our social media, please do give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. I upload videos here twice weekly and I do not want you guys to miss them. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I really hope you enjoyed this one and I will catch you in my next video. Bye.